is a general reading this may or may not resonate okay if it doesn't check out your other placements if you need a personal reading all that information is going to be below nine of wands right off the bat you're guarded from someone you're watching someone you still haven't given up on this person is what i'm getting but um you're very defensive you have trust issues with this person this person could have put you through hell and back or um again nine of cups this person could be someone you know who's like a wish fulfillment for you probably but you have that guardedness okay that defensiveness from yourself um i think this is a situation that's exhausting you okay you've reached that point of exhaustion nearing burnout all right but you're still ready to wait for this person give it one last shot because this person makes you very very happy is what i'm getting the chariot that's a lot of determination to move on or move forward from a situation that's stressing you out with the five of cups here there's a lot of disappointment crying was but no something didn't work out for you it's like well that didn't go the way i expected it to you're willing to move forward you're very willing and determined to move forward okay i don't think you give up um <coughs> I don't think you're waiting for this person. The cards just flew off like that. One second. <clears throat> so yeah, but this card didn't want to come out. Okay, five of cups. See, you're moving forward, moving away from disappointment. Or this could be someone who's wanting to travel towards you. But that's chariot. That's your card here. You feel you're in the right direction, and you're ready to put in the effort and overcome any obstacles that come. <clears throat> don't know what's wrong with my voice, so. a lot of regret a lot of remorse someone's even feeling guilty i'm getting queen of cups you could have given your all to someone okay this is being very very sensitive i think but now you've closed off to this person you've closed off to someone you're not you're no longer giving to this person okay you're wanting to love yourself first respect yourself give yourself you could have over given this person okay like given too much maybe you were very compassionate you were always there for this person you probably thought this was your ten of cups but i guess things didn't pan out the way you expected them to and now you're ready to move forward i don't feel like there's an ending in this relationship but it's just a lot of heavy disappointment a lot of uh uh I'm crying and moping over a situation that's already over and done with you know <clears throat> two sort say i think someone probably wants to come move forward towards you okay with the chariot we can also see that but your garnet you've gone through hell this person probably is missing you a lot they regret what happened but when this person comes in red i feel with the two of swords here you block them out so you have kind of feels someone wants to work with you okay on this relationship they want to build with you but i don't think you're wanting to see the situation with <clears throat> an open heart i feel you need to make a choice when this person comes in and it's going to be like a very stressful decision for you so you're choosing to stay uh, absolutely um say blind to the situation is what i'd say you just want to assume that i don't see this coming and i'm just going to stay in that um unknown energy that's flat out blocking someone right like you've blocked them i'm i'm getting even if this person's coming in with a lot of remorse and regret right even if they want to move forward and come towards you and start something new but for you it's like no i don't think this deserves a second chance because you're very willing to move forward towards this person queen of pentacles <clears throat> what the star here there is a wish that's coming through okay or i feel you've healed from this situation from this connection you are very focused on building your stability security or this is what you always wanted and probably this person is seeing you like this they see you as marriage material but you are very focused on you that's why you're blocking this person out because this person gave you nothing but remorse and regret okay around the situation worried disappointment upset sad tears etc is what i'm hearing and i feel you want to move on from this person you know, your your guards are up 
लगा दरा and this is what your focus is blocking them out and your focus is your money your stability your career etc <coughs> i think with the star here uh it is a wish fulfillment but at the same time that's a lot of healing right queen of cups see she wanted to come out see you know literally what i'm getting is that now you're focusing look see the queen of cups right so she's got that um cup to offer right but at the same time it's shut the cup is shut she's not offering anyone anything i feel now you're doing all the work on yourself whatever you were giving to this person okay that compassionate energy that loving energy okay that unconditional love etc right this time all the focus is going on you it's no longer on them and this is something that this person is regretting or even missing you could have given too much to this relationship okay and now you're overly sensitive you know a little a little fragile maybe you're very dependent on this person okay your warmth and kindness was a little overdose for them and now you're focusing on you that's what i'm getting i feel this is you cancer queen of pentacles and the queen of cups i feel this is you <clears throat> I think even if this person comes in with the charioter, right? Who's wanting to come in? I feel this is someone who's wanting to move on and come towards you, not move on from you, but move forward. They want to come. They want to let go of the regret. Whatever happened, let by pa- pa- let the past be in the past. Let bygones be bygones. I think they're moving towards you, which is going to keep you in this indecisive mode. More more than indecisive, it's like you know you need to make a decision, but you're choosing not to. Seriously, like I don't want to even look at this. You know, like I don't got no time for this kind of thing because I'm very focused on my money, my worth, my stability, my security, and I have no love to offer you. This time I'm gonna put myself first. And with the seven of pentacles, yeah, I feel when this person comes in, right, you're more gonna be like, again, I'm saying I I don't see you as not invested. I see you as someone who's still invested, right? But you're like, no, I don't know if this is gonna work out. I've put in so much, you put in so much work. uh emotions you know you invested so much time in this person hoping from the seven you'll get to the 10 of pentacles probably stability security marriage commitment but when they refuse to give that to you you shut down completely you know and now you're completely questioning and trying to reevaluate the situation when this person comes in like do i want this or not you refuse to put in the work in this person two of pentacles right see <clears throat> Two of Pentacles. This person is trying to balance out a situation, or probably this was someone who is juggling two people. Okay, juggling two people, juggling two situations. Probably they were also contemplating on whether they want to move forward and come towards you or not, right? But I feel this person is trying to come in and balance the situation out between you guys. This could be someone who was neglecting the, their love life or neglecting you. You know, you felt like an outsider in the relationship, but they're coming in. They're coming in with a new perspective. They're coming into. They're they're very willing and determined, is what I'm getting. Okay, someone who definitely wants to make something happen. They're ready to balance that situation out. <clears throat> Three of Wands. You could be waiting for this person. Okay, maybe you're manifesting this person. This person wants forward moment with you with the six of wands here. They want success, and they're very confident they can make it happen with you. They wanna if 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 uh, you're dating, they wanna take things to the next level, to the high level of commitment. If you're committed, they wanna get married to you, whatever. But yeah, there's this uh, uh, self confidence. Okay, there's this want to be successful in something. Okay, like I'm gonna make this happen, and probably they're uh, you're waiting for them to come in. But I three of wands is manifestation, right? So I think your ships are coming in. The ships are coming in. Whilst you're focusing, you're doing you. You pull back from them completely, and now they're coming in. Okay, they're dropping one thing. Okay, whatever was coming between you guys, right, or whatever they were trying to juggle you with. Again, this person could have had a lot on their plate. Very confused. All right, but uh, yeah, they're dropping everything to give you a priority. The hermit. But you're going to take your time. You're contemplating. You're taking a break. You're wanting to think about the situation over and over and over again. <clears throat> you feel the need to pull out, pull away. For sure, you feel the need to pull away. You feel the need to back out. You're not ready for this. I, I think this is more like a strategic withdrawal, okay, which is necessary at that time, rather than doing it. Um, 
uh, to probably you know uh, instigate their ego or you know just like hurt them i feel this is a something very strategic that you're doing okay because you think it's very necessary right now to take your time off and think about something okay you're probably looking to consult within your inner guidance because that's a lot of self introspection right instead of seeking answers outside or validation okay you're trying to look within because you realize that the answers to this lies with you alone i think you're wanting to do a little more research gather more knowledge gather more information okay more like exploring etc okay because the more you know the power, the more power you'll have right let's see again star here it just wants to keep showing its face which is telling me a reconciliation b that you do need this healing and c star is something destined something fated which is coming in for you okay you can deny it as much as you want but it's there in your destiny they're coming in you can think about it as much as you want right but this is in your destiny okay and they're coming in the ships are coming in <clears throat> say four of swords i'm choose I, i'm thinking that when this person comes in i don't know if you're ready to entertain this person you know <clears throat> you're constantly in that break 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 mode you know you want to be more refreshed you could be nearing a burnout okay and i think it's probably this has made you very restless but you want like that mental health you know which is like a uh, very that, that resting self care kind of moment okay look at that hermit and the four of swords is right next to it which means that this break is very very necessary for you look with the magician the temperance the king of cups this person loves you very very much okay let's give it this person loves you very very much and now they're getting into their senses maybe this person was someone who had trust issues they were emotionally unavailable very detached you know they didn't have a good control over their head and their heart okay so probably they were being very cold and very hot and cold you know someone who was very afraid to show their emotions okay but now i think there has been some time they've got their shit in um place i feel with the magician here right they're coming in to make things happen they're manifesting this reunion with you they're manifesting this someone's in full blown manifestation mode and with the temperance here i feel that there's someone here who's done a lot of healing someone who's taken their own time okay before they come back to you or it could just mean that something's needed a lot of patience and after this patience after this healing time this is what's coming in for you but again you probably feel the need to hold back a little more longer because probably again i'm getting nine of wands right that's like exhaustion that's like the wounded warrior right tired battered wounded you know exhausted burned out but still you're still holding on to this person you're still holding on i don't see you as giving up yet but it's just that you could have gone through so much with this person you are like i don't know if i want to do this again okay because you tire me out you know you exhaust me <clears throat> So yeah, I think there could be a continuation of a new communication between you guys. Maybe willingly you're choosing to not communicate with this person. Okay? Like I said, two of swords, right? This is what I'm getting very drawn to. It's like I don't want to see it. I don't want to even look at your messages. I don't trust you. I don't want to talk to you. I don't know what you're doing. I mean, I give you like a hundred chances, or more like you know, I don't know what's happening. You know, but, I mean, where were you all this while? Why should I even look at you? You know, stuff like that. <clears throat> like my my love is shut out for you okay i waited for you all this while what the hell were you doing you know now i'm too focused too too busy on my uh, too busy working on me <clears throat> a lot of two minds here you know two of swords two of pentacles right in decision <clears throat> what is the outcome for cancer in love what is the outcome for cancer in love the world i feel you're moving forward you're closing the cycle that's an ending sorry the world is also closing chapters okay ending a chapter in your life and starting a new chapter or completely getting a closure about something okay but with the world here six of wands and the lovers here i feel you guys are getting into reunion for sure okay someone's very someone's very confident that they can make things happen someone's awakening you know awakening to that soulmate twin flame connection with the lovers here probably this was a one sided situation one person was more emotionally involved than the other <clears throat> fear of commitment lack of balance you know 
one person did feel it or was like literally like the runner chaser is what I'm getting, like a typical twin flame story. One more card. What is the outcome for cancer at the end of the day? Give me one more card. Yep. <clears throat> Knight of Swords, Ten of Wands. Someone's feeling very, very burdened, okay, with the fact that you're not talking to them. They're going nuts. Someone's going back to crazy. I feel someone's probably even coming out of isolation and wanting to talk to you, but you choose to stay silent. You choose to pull back. I mean, your ships are literally coming in. They are. They're coming in to communicate. This is more like confrontation. So don't expect something like sweet and emotional. It's more like uh, the swords, right? This is like someone who's rushing in to communicate, right? Like it, it could even create a conflict. But this looks to me more like confrontation, okay? Like, let's just start this. Let's start a new chapter because you're avoiding me. And with the Ten of Wands and the Four of Wands here, you know, I want a brand new beginning with you. I'm releasing the old burdens, okay? I'm letting go of whatever was coming between us. And with the Four of Wands here, this person could definitely want something very stable, very committed to you, okay? And with the Ace of Wands here, this person has clarity. They have clarity, <clears throat> they're coming in to clear the air with you, okay? And they're dead, dead serious about this. And with the Ten of Swords, it looks like they're putting an end to the bullshit, okay? This all is happening after they had that ending with you. Just realize your worth and value, okay? This is someone who probably was remaining to be single for a very long time. But it seems like this person was like, you know what? They were okay on their own. They were absolutely happy. They wanted that all the attention on themselves, okay? Could be an attention seeker, but someone who is absolutely fine, okay? They didn't feel the need to be in a commitment or in a relationship. But from the time you walked away, I feel this person feels that they have everything, but you're the missing piece in the puzzle. And they're coming back. They're feeling very codependent on you. <clears throat> they're coming back. They see you as independent, doing you. You're absolutely fine. You don't give a shit to this person. And that's when they're probably going to realize that, you know what? I messed up. They're coming into balance the situation. I think you're the one who's very guarded here. Nine of Wands here. That's you. They're coming out of isolation, okay? They're, they, they have this kind of a realization, okay? Kind of an epiphany. They're coming out of that isolation if they've completely ghosted you. And they've come, they've come to that kind of... Something's come to light, Okay? They've realized that they messed up again. Like I said, they're coming in to talk to you. There's communication coming in quick. And with the world here, I feel you're ready to start a new cycle with this person. Of course, it's going to be up to you. We all have free will, whether you want to let them in or not. But yeah, there's a chapter that's ending. You're getting something's coming to an end and there's something new that's starting within your life. Okay. It could be within this. Doesn't always have to be an ending to this person. I feel there's a new chapter opening in your life with this person okay whatever you guys had to go through you guys have learned your lessons and they're coming in to start another chapter with you okay <clears throat> that's what i have for you cancer i hope this reading resonates and i will see you next time Bye bye